Hey everybody, it's Karen from Waterfall Acrylics. Welcome back. Video number 46. Tonight I'm going to do a pour on an 18 inch wooden round. Um, I can't show you the painting from yesterday because it's been a mere 24 hours and it's still um, not ready to be handled. Um, that's the uh, the red burst. I don't know what to call that one yet. Um, I did do a little one with the leftover pour. If you watched that video, you know I had leftover paint. And since it was just glue and water, I'm happy to report it dried fine. And I did this little little guy and it dried in like a day. And um, I already peeled off the tape and uh, you know the edges. And I will resin this in a couple weeks when I know it's really cured. And then hopefully when it's resin, it'll look something like this guy, all nice and shiny. This was another little guy I did with leftover pour. These are just my little pop-up arts. I put them on little easel and sell them. And hopefully, I always think of people who uh, work in offices and you know spend eight hours in a cubicle. Maybe they need a nice little pop of color in their cubicle. So those are my little pop-up arts I um, wanted to show you. The only thing I wanted to show you that I was excited about was this was a pour I did, I don't know, three months ago. This is just uh, my GAC 800 and paint experiment. I love this little guy. I don't think I filmed it, but what I did do is send away for a brand new phone case. And they made it. Look! Oh, I'm so excited. Wait, how's it go? How's it lowering up? Something like that. Um, I did notice like this red part is much more subdued in the actual painting because it's right there. But beggars can't be choosers, I guess. So... But very fun. These are um, by a company called Caseify, and I like them because they're wallet style. And they really should pay me for this free advertisement, don't you think? I think so. Anyway, let's get down to the canvas, get to work. I was goofing off a lot today, um, experimenting, but I didn't record anything, and nothing was really worth it, trust me. How does that look? Uh, did I get most of it in there? Come up below. It's pretty big. 18 inches. I think that's it. It has been um, primed already um, and it's already taped on the back. Like, can you see that? Like that. It's, um, I put three coats of kills. Where's my can of kills? I use this stuff. You can use gesso if you like. Um, I like this um, primer. Um, it, it dries super fast in like 15 minutes. So I have three coats of that on there and it doesn't leave any lines or anything. So it's really nice. I got this round at Home Depot. It's 18 inch. It's about an inch thick and they're less than 10 bucks. Um, so pretty good deal and definitely, definitely treat it before you decide to pour on it. Don't pour on untreated wood. And also, I would go ahead and sand around the edges. You want those nice and smooth. Um, can I show you? I know I missed a spot on here. See, like right there. Can you see where there's little tiny ridges? That's where I missed. And I'm not going to go bother back and bother resanding that. But give it a good sand and a good prime before you start. So colors tonight are not a lot of colors. Um, and I've been wanting to do these colors for a long time. So I have a big old cup of Liquitex, just regular gold. I am still on that deep red kick, which is the Alizarin and Crimson U Permanent, the heavy body by Liquitex. And then a cup of my Blick, my gloss Mars Black. And then my Cronacridone, this is Red Light by Senlier, number 672. Um, red Light, it's it's pure pink all the way. At least it's not Pepto-Bismol pink, it's a nice shade of pink. So those are the only colors um, I'm using. I have, I filled these up so full that I had to make, um, pour some into other cups. So I have spare cups and then as usual, um, I have a big old cup of titanium white. Um, pouring medium recipe. This is, I'm going to try it again. I'm, I'm no quitter. I'm trying. 
Uh, what did I do? I mixed up a big batch. Like, um, I think I did eight ounces of Elmer's Glue All in my little quart cup with eight ounces of water and four ounces of Liquitex Pouring Medium, uh, mostly to help prevent it from cracking or crazing. I think it was crossed this time. Um, and it'll go under a tarp like sealed under a tarp for at least a week. I won't even look at it. I'll take all my pictures tonight, won't even look at it. So um, consistency wise, what's a good color to show you? Black, like this. Oh, that's sticking to the uh, stick. Barely leaves a mound. A mound for about a second, that's called the trace. When it hits the, um, when the paint hits the paint in the cup, it dissipates, not immediately, but within a second. So that's the consistency I was going for in all my colors. I'm gonna put all the cups up here for a second so I can add my uh, treadmill silicone. As usual, you guys know I like my spot on. Um, all colors except the white. So there's all the extra cups. And I don't know why I have this one so full and this one half empty, so let me do this a second. All right, and I didn't want as much pink in the painting. Um, that was just more like a highlight. So I'm gonna put three drops. More. Did I do you? You get two, you're little. All right, light stir, not much. And we'll get going. All right, let's take some of the cups, put them to the side. Excuse the mess underneath. I was playing before. And the black off. So there's my four colors, my white. And I'm going to do... Do I need two? I'm going to do three larger cups. And if I have extra, or I think I need it, I might make one smaller one, um, too. So that's the plan. Let me move these out and think about my order. So, I think I'm gonna go Let me think about this. I think I'm gonna change them up in the in the uh, cups too. I'm not gonna do all the cups the same. So we'll just start off with my tea white. Get it going first. So a lot of comments on um my YouTube channel today, and for Christy who told me that Vince here um, looked like another artist, Will, Will, oh, I forgot his last name. I'll put it in my um, description so you could follow him, but it's another cool painter, and she said it looked just like him, and I think the guy, that artist, is actually better looking. And then someone else said Vince looks like um, Conan O'Brien, and I totally get that, totally see it. And then a third person said, they cut off the wrong ear. And that was just me being an idiot because both ears were removable and I had the bandage on the wrong ear. So I fixed them. So Vince is there hanging out, chilling, relaxing. So we're gonna go black. Ooh, let's layer black, hello. Hmm. Let me pour this one down the side since I did not want to layer. There we go. Alright. Black. Let's do the gold. Maybe I'll get, maybe it'll be quicker. I'll do I'll do the uh the side cup action tonight. 
maybe my uh, video will go a little quicker. As usual though, if you don't want to hear me yammering on, please fast forward. I won't be offended. Do what you gotta do. Busy lives, whatnot. I just talked to you yesterday, so I don't have a whole lot of stories to uh, share. Other than, let's see, what was the most exciting thing in my day? Uh, we heard from the company who's coming to put in brand new closets for us. Because uh, I might have done a kit for one closet, but we're doing four. And I was like, that's too much work. So we're paying somebody to do it. And I can't wait because some of our closets are literally being held together with hanger wire and zip ties. So that'll be awesome to have that done. Otherwise, all's quiet. All right, let me go back. Let me do a little white. Got the big boy cup. I don't think I've ever done this with like a pour like this. Um, where I use the side of the cup. I like to do my lines and layer. Yeah. Which I'm gonna go back to doing. So let me layer some gold on here now. I'm gonna change up the order. Just for giggles, for no good reason whatsoever. Gold, 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 lots of gold. I better slow down on the gold. Let's go, let's go crimson, or whatever color this is. Just a little, because it was just under there. A couple big layers and a couple little layers. And then go pink. Yep, let's see, I'm gonna kill off the pink, because I didn't want a lot of pink. So this will be it. Pink, let's do my little layer of white. Not a lot. I forgot to make the fourth little cup. Oh well. We'll have to hope this is enough. I guess I still could since I didn't want pink in it anyway. Yeah, screw it. Uh, Alright, some black. Gold. Gold. I 
swapped out all my clothes today from summer to winter. It always makes me sad. Put away the summer clothes. I'm always an optimist though and keep out like a one pair of shorts. Just you know. For that random November day when it's 69 degrees. I'm kind of bummed that um, the leaves here haven't changed yet either. It's what, like October 25th? And they're still kind of like faded green. Very sad looking. So. All right, the gold. And the crimson, and that'll be it. Hold on, let's see, I'm lefty, I gotta go the other way. Earlier, I did um, a couple of uh, used canvases um, or paintings that were old that I hated and um, did some fun practice pours doing like the traveling pour. Um, but I added silicone to mine, so they really didn't feather up. The whole thing just ended up selling up. You really couldn't tell that it was a, um, a straight pour. You could have sort of kind of on the edges, but um, that was so fun. All right, let me do, how much did I splooge off? Not a lot, all right. Um. Oh, he's moving all around. Jeez, I don't have the uh, flipping mojo tonight. That's all right. Nope, not at all. I did um, go ahead and, and rim my uh, clear cups with silicone to help the paint fly out. Maybe that's why they splooge so easy. Um, so it should, yeah, see they're coming down pretty fast. I don't think I'm gonna have to wait very long. No, let's go ahead and give this guy a flip and drag. I dare I'll save that paint. It's in that cup. Yeah, see, he didn't need that fourth cup. Let's do this guy. There's the pink. Try to save some paint in this guy. No, oh, totally did not. Oh, yes, I did. Okay. Mm, pretty cells already. I'm gonna let that sit for a second. It's running off right here a little bit, but that's all right. Let's go like this. Tilt it up a little. I'm gonna run that white off anyway. Are done moving around? I love this, the red and the pink and the gold. <gasps> so pretty. All right, let me throw on some gloves. Let me wipe off my fingers. I had a scare earlier. Um, couple hours ago because I was painting this afternoon I went to put on my gloves and I had my um, engagement ring on and I usually take it and set it to the side and I thought I had slipped it into my apron pocket and then after I was done painting I went and washed my apron 
And then I was like, oh, I washed my ring. Oh no, what if it went down the drain? And then I ran downstairs and looked in my apron pockets and there was nothing there. And I kind of freaked out, but it was like two feet away on the kitchen counter here. So false alarm. I wish I had more black. Um, and boy, the cells really, really grew, didn't they? Which uh, makes me a little hesitant to torch right now. And I think I'm just going to tilt first. Because um, if I torch, I don't think I'll have any background. Or maybe I just do it like right there and right there. That's it. Um, because look at those guys. They're pretty big already, right? You go sideways for the heat without the flame, except for that guy. Pop that bubble. Yeah, see that? It's gonna. Watch this. And, uh, little white speckles. That's interesting. And maybe some. Oh, pink cells. You guys probably can't see that, but I can. get rid of this white so that's a goner right off the bat oh my god it's so heavy it is heavy it's a big chunk of wood I'm telling you and let me go over this way and get rid of that swath of red doesn't kind of go come down this way stretch out those see those cells really grew Sometimes you can just tell. I can come off this way, even if I lose some cells. And then just back over here. Off the end, and then back over here. This might be a fast, easy one, y'all. Wow, some giant cells. Holy moly. Get my finger out of that one. We got a fish right there. Let me just stare a second. Do I want to add more? See, I like being able to see this background right there and here. I think I want to tilt a little. I don't like that right there. Can you see where I'm pointing? Yeah. Um, I'm gonna go over that way for a second. Oh, we dry out my muscles. Try to get back. Just doesn't have to go off all the way, but just not so prominent. And then come back, even things out a little bit. Yeah, see, not so prominent. Wow. I'm kind of liking this. My favorite part is right here, and I don't have. I wish I had more of that, but man, I don't think I'm going to complain at all about this piece. And I have a couple air bubbles I need to zap, but otherwise, you know what? I'm quitting while I'm ahead. Um, touch up my sides. Let me see my sides. I do love being able to walk around my kitchen island. Sides look great all the way around. Yeah. We're going to uh, quit while we're ahead. So fast and easy, not a lot of chatter. Um, where's my torch? I just had it. Where is it? Oh, it's right in front of me. Oh my goodness. Um, bubble right there. Oh, got some, oh, pretty pink under there. Maybe I will get that little torch. Oh, of course, those are black, but that's okay. Those are really pretty. They're cute. Maybe just a couple here. What do you think? Somebody say something. I guess you can't. Oh, see, that was worth it right there. Whoa, that's pretty. And this guy here, just because he bugs me. Anywhere else? Do I dare do anything else? Maybe right there. And that's it. 
Ta-da! As I like to say. Uh, super happy with that. It, um, almost matched the vision in my head. My vision in my head had a little more, um, the black was a little bit more prominent but I've been dying to do that, that color scheme and I don't know if it conveys on the camera, maybe when I zoom in, particularly over here, there's a lot of depth and you can see like the clear layers with the gold underneath, um, really, really pretty. So, yay, uh, yeah, super happy. Um, where are you guys? Oh, I don't wanna get my shirt dirty. Uh, where? Where are you guys? Uh, yeah, look at that. Under 30 minutes. Woohoo! Um, thanks for watching. Thanks for your support. Don't paint in my hair. That's no, okay. Uh, please check me out if you're so inclined. Um, tell your friends, go to Waterfall Acrylics, maybe buy something for Christmas. I'm going to be um, loading up some inventory with pricing um, so you can see. And I think I'm going to have a sale um, just to hopefully clear out some inventory um so check it out and um let me zoom in for you take care guys bye bye all right let me come down here without turning this off and zoom in try to hold it still over here oh let me come over here and show you my favorite part i love the dark the red with the pink on top isn't it pretty it's so pretty, and I love this whole section right there, too. Um, where'd it go? There, right there. That's so pretty. Great cells. Um, really pretty right there with the little zap. And then this whole area over here. Wait, where am I? Right here. Super, super pretty. And then the black in the middle is awesome. Let me come up high. And I'll take good pictures. Um... Yay, that's it. Uh, I'm going to say see you guys soon. Bye-bye.